Aviation industry manufacturers are taking a more environmentally friendly approach to flying. Major companies, along with startups, are working on possible ways to make commercial electric aircraft a reality within a few years. Today, we'll talk about the first fully electric powered airplane being mass produced now, called the Alpha Electro. The Alpha Electro is a lightweight, battery powered two seater manufactured by Slovenian based light aircraft maker Pipistrel. It's the company's second generation electric model that comes with a higher battery capacity and less engine weight. The aircraft weighs just 350 kilograms and can carry a maximum payload of 200 kilograms. It's built mainly for training purposes, but the company also offers to buy the aircraft for $129,000. The cost is close to a petrol engine plane, but the maintenance is almost free. The electric-powered aircraft dramatically reduces both fuel consumption and the disruptive noise, especially when conducting training on smaller airfields closer to towns. The aircraft needs 150 meters takeoff run and can reach a maximum 1200 FPM climbing rate, which means it can climb 6 meters a second. The 60 kilowatt electric motor is powered by a 21 kilowatt hours battery pack that provides one hour flying time with an extra 30 minutes in reserve. It's not enough for cross country trips, but is perfect for covering short distances and ideal for those who want to learn flying. One of the biggest advantages of the Alpha Electro is that you have to spend just $3 to get a full charge, which is about 10 times less than for standard gasoline models, thus making flying more affordable than ever before. It can develop a top speed of 70 nautical miles per hour, which is equal to 80 miles per hour. The company says the Alpha Electro is optimized for traffic pattern operations, where 13% of energy is recuperated on every approach, increasing endurance and at the same time enabling short field landings. Pipistrel is also cooperating with Uber on the development of an electric vertical takeoff and landing for urban mobility, like the Airbus that already conducted the first successful test flight of its Vahana electric VTOL about two months ago. Electric motors turn out to be more efficient in converting energy into power, especially during takeoff, when the aircraft requires double the power that it requires in cruise. The main issue is related to the batteries that don't yet provide the necessary flying range to be enough for long-haul trips. But thanks to battery technology improvements, that issue might disappear very soon. It seems our environment will again be green and noise and pollution free to secure a clean and sustainable future. If you agree, then please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more interesting videos. Thanks for watching and see you next time.